Hey guys, French RIT here, back with another video. And today, we're going to be doing a modded thing, whatever you call it, of the Elite Demolisher. Or, yeah, it's called the Demolisher 2 and 1. What you're supposed to do with it, <laughs> batteries go in here. I'm pretty sure it uses AA batteries, I forget. Changed the batteries in a long time, it's been a long time. But So, it has, it comes with a banana clip. 10 round mag, um, has a standard Nerf Elite rail on top, you can open this up to see all the darts inside of it, um, what you do, there's supposed to be a little area down the bottom of here, that you put a little rocket in it, and you go, and it shoots the rocket, so you go, boom, like that, and it just shoots the rocket, and then the cool thing about this gun, which barely any guns really do, until the past few, until like the past two years, is this. It's motor power. So, yeah, um, yeah, I'm gonna show you guys how this gun works and like how it fires and everything. And then I'm going to mod this gun. So, yeah. We'll be right back. So guys, we're standing about. 10 feet away right now. I'm right here beside the iPad. So, let's shoot this thing. Alright, it's out. Wow, I blew that load fast. Alright, let's get to modifying it. Be right so back. So, guys, starting off, we have the AK-47 status. I'm just kidding. It doesn't have to be an AK-47, but... We have the modern day weapon status, I guess you would call it. But yeah, it's pretty much uh, it's just an AK-47 on here. So yeah, that's that's how that works. Um, who really cares? Alright, so let's get to the next gun. Alright, you ready guys? I'm going to hit the gun and it's going to transfer to the next gun. Okay? You ready? Three, two, one, go. Awesome. Well, now, guys, we've got ourselves the sniper status, which I don't have modulus barrels because I don't have a modulus yet, so I can't attach modulus barrels. But I think the only thing that really makes this a sniper status is the mag and the scope. Oh my gosh, the scope doesn't want to stay on. There we go. Scope's on. You don't want to turn that on and go single shot, really. You can't use the trigger here unless you turn this on, so. I mean, you could do semi automatic sniping, that'd be fun. Hmm. 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 Well, alright, guys, we're gonna transfer to the next gun. Um, you ready? Three, two, one, go. Whoa! Jeez. Okay, um, guys, right here, we have got the heavy gunner, or the guy who basically tries to spew foam as fast as he can, and destroy everybody. So, support gunner, you know, like, stun this back, and boom. There you go. That is basically a support gunner, um... I'm getting my hyperfire. It'll be shipped in here tomorrow. So yeah, that's what's gonna happen. Is I'm gonna get my hyperfire in tomorrow. So yeah, let's switch to the next gun. And I think this is gonna be the final gun. You ready? Three, two, one, go! Oh my gosh! Holy moly! Okay, guys. So right now we have got the attachments guy. Or the guy who thinks every single attachment that you can put on a gun is freaking important. Boom. The bigger the gun, the better, apparently, according to this guy. It's freaking huge. I mean, come on, dude. Nobody does this, except for those idiots. You got the drum mag. You got a scope that's not even supposed to be on this Nerf gun. You got the long strike barrel with the little dart holder on the bottom of it. You got a Raider SC-35 back, or stock, and you got the Raider SC-35 drum. 
So yeah. That's the that's this is the attachments guy. This thing is freaking huge. I mean, how'd you like to be standing in front of this thing? I really wouldn't to be honest. So yeah. Um that's the attachments guy. So I think that's about all I can think up of right now is sniper status, AK-47 guy, or just AK guy, heavy gunner, and attachments guy. So, yeah. I'll see you guys in the next episode. See ya.